Leap is about leadership empowerment and achieving your potential. It started in 2008 when I was working at Hammersmith and Fulham Primary Care Trust, an NHS organization. And at the time, I noticed that if you're from a black and ethnic minority background, you tend to be in positions that are lower positions and you're overrepresented at low levels and underrepresented in higher management leadership positions. And so I created LEAP to help people with career progression, for them to take responsibility of their career and be the change that they want to see in the world. Coming in this course, I was thinking, okay, that's it. But as I can see that there's no restriction, there's, not, there's no boundaries. I can push myself forward and I can trust me, myself. So this workshop is the final workshop and it's about empowering presentations. And it's when the participants all give a five minute presentation about their journey on LEAP and they share a little bit about a small improvement project that they've been working on. And they present this to the chief executive and the head of equality and diversity. Being on this course has really, really empowered me. And, and what I've learned is to be even more positive with what I want to achieve in life. The LEAP program has really made me more confident in presentation and how to deal with stress. And it's something that everyone needs in their workplace. And I wanted us to take some time and have a walk of reflection and for the group to come together and walk past statues of other famous leaders like Gandhi, Winston Churchill and go past the Houses of Parliament where a lot of decisions are made. And we walked over Westminster Bridge where you could see St. Thomas's Hospital and you could see Mary Seacole's statue which looks directly at the Houses of Parliament and I thought it would be a beautiful way for us to end and celebrate the achievement of the participants that completed the programme and took the leap. The significance of the Mary Seacole Memorial statue in the grounds of St Thomas's Hospital in London is that it recognises that it might take a long time but you can get there in the end. And the second is that it's the first statue to a named woman of colour in this country, the first statue to a named black woman. Mary Seacole's important uh, on a number of fronts. She overcame prejudice and achieved her objective of nursing British soldiers in the Crimean War. And you know, she was a woman of many skills. She was an entrepreneur as well as a nurse. So she was a feisty black woman, but proud of her mixed heritage as well. Through doing LEAP I've noticed there's a huge hidden talent and there's a whole group of people that really love working in the NHS or whatever organisation they're in and they want to make a difference and we're not really utilising their full potential and talent so they're coming in to work but they could be doing so much more and they could be happier while they're doing their jobs. Three words to describe LEAP. Empowering, inspirational,